So here at Foot and Ankle Associates, often our patients will have to wear a dressing because of a wound or a surgery, and in some cases even a cast if they had a fracture or a bigger procedure done. Uh, when you have that done, obviously it makes bathing difficult, so we want to make sure that that dressing or cast stays dry. The way we protect that is with one of these shower protectors, which has a little rubber gasket on the top here to, to connect to your leg. And these are pretty effective at preventing water getting in. So what you do when you apply this is you, first and foremost, you need to open up the hole there. It is rubber, so it will tend to grab to the skin or to the, the dressing. So you want to open it up as wide as you can. And you slide the foot inside. Now obviously we do it the correct way so that the toes are in the right direction. And obviously when you're doing this to yourself, you can be much more cautious on how quickly you put it on so you don't hurt yourself. And then once you get on the leg, you kind of pull it down slightly. And what that does, it creates a ramp effect. The water will want to roll down off the, the actual uh, a bag. And, you, and depending on what you've had done, sometimes you can put your foot down in the shower. Uh, some people will actually take a bath, and they'll hang their leg out the side. And that way, if any water would be done, that, this would protect that. If it were to leak and get on your dressing or your cast, obviously call the office right away. So we'd need to, uh, to talk to you if there's any reason we'd have to replace that at that point. But this is very simple, just make sure that when you're in the shower, if you have like a wand to use, that you try to keep the leg off the side and use the wand to bathe the rest of your body so water doesn't run on top of this. And this is the shower protector for uh, a, a post-operative bandage or a cast.